Hi friends, Christmas is hitting all the Dollar Trees, so today I'm taking you to three. Let's go shopping. Well, I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the wishes. And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. Tell me one thing. Is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you so I thought it'd be a whole lot of fun to show you guys what different Dollar Trees carry. So today we're hitting three stores. We're starting off in the plus section in the first store. They do have these fur covered trees. They're $5. Now they do have some silver in some of them and gold in others. They also have some metallic trees. And down here I'm finding some adorable Christmas aprons for $5 in three different prints. This one is vintage retro. This could be a Halloween costume. So cute for $5. Now they're also putting out some wreaths now i think that's a pretty fair price five dollars for a pretty full berry wreath they also have this one with some pretty good greenery on it i'm not too sad about that one now this is fun this is a metal scroll style sign it is embossed it comes in the two versions jingle all the way in red and peace on earth in green and oh my goodness you guys for five dollars they have these really nice metal signs now the metal is thin but for five dollars these are dupes for things that i have seen at Hobby Lobby. Now they come in three prints, two Santas, and this super cute vintage little snowman and deer. So cute. Now I'm doing a close up so you guys can get an idea of the sizing right down there in the bottom, but basically they're like close to two feet tall and they do have that kickstand on the back. This is the other Santa. So vintage. I love his little face and the deer at his feet. $5 metal leaner is what they're called. Now they also have these pot holders for five dollars and they are grouped in pairs of two so not so bad i do love some of the prints are doing a lot of the vintage looking with the lighter colors now they also have these for five dollars have you used these let me know please comment i'm very tempted so they're three inflatable outdoor ornaments and i would love to know your experience with them because i'm very very tempted to do something with them outdoors now they brought back these massive ornament garlands for five dollars amazing can't beat it they have the little sleds those are three dollars they also have these they almost look like a needle point and those are three dollars they also have the ornaments with mary noel and joy on them and again those are three dollars i do love the greenery that they did this year it is very realistic a nice upgrade for these signs that we saw last year as well now they also have some large oversized stars these are metal so they're five dollars they come in the red and white and okay i'm not a huge fan of their lanterns but look what they did they put three candles inside of this little black one i just love that i think it's adorable now they're also putting out some really nice doormats and i mean these are pretty thick i'm tempted to buy them so they have a lot of different prints this one is so retro and vintage they also have this one that i think is timeless and welcome but my favorite is this one enjoy to the world neutral enough but festive enough and you can't beat that price for five dollars and again super heavy duty now i want to mention something because i found an empty carton at the store it had been filled with these, which you can find at dollartree.com, and they are the vintage style Christmas trees that light up for $5. Now, over in the ornament section, I was finding these, and these are new. Again, the quality's not coming across on camera, but they are super heavy. A very nice item, very large. Now they have the snowflakes in the gold. They also have it in the silver. I was surprised they didn't do it in white, but they did do it in blue. So if you have any frozen lovers in your life or you are a glam person, check these out. They're very nice, but they are covered in glitter. Now they're starting to put out some of their tinsel items. We're going to see different ones at different stores, which is really interesting. But they're also starting to put out the tinsel trees. Those are $1.25 and some signs. So I think that a few of these could be great if you are into either wreath making or maybe making a little Santa cam. I think those would go perfectly with it. And look at this. I'm not a friend of the truck but oh my gosh gingerbread yes 
big fan. Candy Cane Lane. I love that one. I've never seen that before. A few of these look familiar. I can't remember quite what we saw, but we're going to see different signs at different stores, which is interesting. Now they're also putting this one out over here in a little island they're putting together. So I'm thinking it's going to be all the elves. Now up top, I found these. They're interesting. They could be like a little pen holder. So they're two sided. They come in the snowman, the gnome and Santa. Now down here, they've got lots of DIY items like ornaments. They've got some of the little elves hitting the shelves and some of the gnomes, including LED string lights of gnomes and all kinds of gnome things from tinsel garland to stockings. They have these in a red, in a light gray and in a dark gray. So if you're gnoming it up this year, hit the Dollar Tree. They've even got gnomes in their Christmas section. And over here in their DIY section, I did notice some gnomes up there as well. Now they're also putting out these fun vertical snowflakes in two versions. So it's basically four of them strung and they've got the ice skates. These are so cute. They have a little snowflake on them. They're wood. You get two of them for $1.25. Some new bottle brush trees. These are fun. They come in a green, sort of a lavender. That's not really pink in person and a blue. And in the craft section, I'm finding some fun items. This could definitely be a Christmas DIY in the VW. I also found a gnome on ice skates in this box. And look at this. I think I know who could use this in a Christmas DIY. Now we are magically transported to our second Dollar Tree of this video and they've got new things here as well. They're putting out some of these ornaments in the red, green, and silver. They're putting out lots of of ribbon at this store tons of it and there's a few things over here i want to show you that the other two stores did not have the first being these little trees they have them just set up right here along the ledge under the ornaments they're dollar 25 piece i'm sure they might put out larger ones in the plus section but these are just a dollar 25 there are actually two different or three different types of flat plaid as well as the black and white they brought the buckets back they have these gnomes okay now i've never seen these gnomes in my store they are huge like they are quite a good size so if you're a gnome lover no i'm not but uh, no judgment <laughs> they also have some potted poinsettias and this was interesting their diy ornaments they're putting sayings on how do you feel about that? They've got the truck on one. They've got the most wonderful time of the year on this one. And it's a joyful something. I couldn't quite make out the gold. Now they've got all the ornaments I've showed you guys in our last video, but they've got all of the miniature ornaments. They've put out their whole section for the mini trees and so many cute items. I love these gingerbread on the metal. Those are so cute. You get six for $1.25. They also have some little tag style ones in wood and my favorite is over here through these little plaid stockings they also have some little snowflakes they've got more of those glitter covered snowflakes and they have the tree collars at the store now there's two of them here the red and merry christmas and the metal in farm fresh christmas trees they've got all the trees lined up along the bottom and more tree skirts so they've got this one in the red and black they've got one in a snowflake and then they've got the tinsel red with the white trim they also have a santa wreath form which i thought was pretty interesting over here lots of blanks for crafting and wood pieces tons of elves so many elves i can't even believe it now these sell out every year so if you want some elves get them now because you saw at the last store they didn't have a ton now they have a whole gnome island set up so they've got these two signs in the blue and in the green and those are the ornament style they also have a bunch of garden stakes up top this tinsel gnome, which I think might give me nightmares. <laughs> and they have all of the pot holders and hot pads and dish towels. Now I think this one's kind of cute because they're having cocoa. That's that's doable for me. Um, down here they also have the gnome in gray. So just as tall. If I had to guess, I'd say like 13 inches. 
And then over here, they've got some of their ornaments and crafty items, but they're also stacking signs that will be hitting the shelves pretty soon. Down here, a couple of signs we didn't see in the last store. It's the most wonderful time of the year on white. Now the wonderful on these signs is metal attached to the press board backing. So just know that they do have some dimension. They're really pretty. I do love all the miniatures that they're putting out. So if you are someone who likes little tiny things like ginger bread you may want to check out your craft section they also have a really cute nativity and there are some stacked snowflakes in the back now behind me is the other side of the gnome heaven which is a couple of believe and welcome signs they also have the two little picks i like when they put the picks with different hats together because that gives you options so hey dollar tree could you do that from now on um they have lots of gnome signs so no lack of gnomes at the Dollar Tree. Now these are so cool. This is an oversized hanging solar ornament. So I can just picture this hanging from an outdoor tree. It is going to illuminate at night by itself. These are $5 for the larger ones, but they do have these smaller ones in the same box that are $3. So definitely a Dollar Tree Plus item. The color scheme looks like it's red, green, gold, and blue. And I bet these are really cool all lit up at night. Now, I lost the footage, but they do have the four foot tree out for $5. So just beware. They also have all the signs that we saw at the last door and the stars. And they had these signs that are really well done. Oh, holy night. Merry Christmas and this one in the farm fresh trees. So those are actually $5 signs down here. They have some gnomes that we didn't see at the other store. So these are $5 items, quite a good size and all kinds of costumes and outfits to go with them. Now over here are some oversized blow up inflatables. So these are four feet. They have a penguin. They have a snowman. They have a Santa Claus and a Christmas tree and so I'm guessing these, once you blow them up, you'd have to put them somewhere they wouldn't blow away. They also have the lanterns here. And uh, now we're just magically transported to our third Dollar Tree. They're starting to put out a few little signs. They're also putting out tinsel items and they didn't have the toy soldier at the last two stores or the Christmas tree or the snowflakes. So it is so fun to go to different Dollar Trees and see what they're putting out. They also have these in a box that I think are gonna just sell out immediately. Fun little picks for your Christmas trees, decorating. They also have these fun little house ornaments in three different prints. Those are just $1.25. And in the plus section, they have the little houses. Now these are $5 a piece. I think I remember these from last year, but I did notice that there was one online that we didn't see in store so i think someone came along and swiped it it is a gingerbread so keep your eye open it's five dollars it's a standing house and if it's not sold out at your store it will be they also have more of the inflatables but they didn't have the candy cane at the last one and that one looks pretty good it's six feet tall so over here a few things we haven't seen are some of the lights the incandescent lights and they've got the taller signs here those are five dollars i did notice online they had so many christmas prints so just beware there's probably more coming to a store near you they also have the little standing gingerbread over here they have some of the same signs and i have to tell you guys i was so excited because their craft section has stuff we didn't see in the last few craft sections i'm just going to point out the best so this is a felt garland pre-cut gingerbread oh my goodness they also have the snowflakes now is Dollar Tree just trying to get away with not putting six in a bag by putting them on a string? Just a thought. They also have the lanterns. They come in green in a Christmas tree, red in the deer, and white in the snowflake. But beware because um, some of them are already coming apart. They are super lightweight plastic. So I guess that's what you get for $1.25. Now they brought back the wooden gingerbread houses. I did some DIYs with those last year. They also have the felt gingerbread cutouts in full size and the gingerbread in wood. Now in the plus section, they're putting out some Christmas leggings for $5. I thought that was fun. And I'm also finding some throws, not in the Christmas section, but definitely could go that way in these colors for five dollars in the kitchen section a gnome spatula so keep your eyes out in all departments now i want to cover all of the floral with you guys 
and we are going back to all three stores quickly. The first store didn't have much, but they had a few little picks I wanted to point out. Now these are done quite well. We're gonna hit those in the next store. They had also the berries in little bundles on an end cap and all of the glitter vase filler, as well as these oversized poinsettia clips in all the metallics. Now they're bringing back all their poinsettias and tons of the glitter covered eucalyptus. And just remember when you're picking out your poinsettias that there are gonna be different ones to choose from. There's gonna be some covered in glitter and some not pick the ones that are not. Now these snow branches are done really well and I think that those are gonna sell out quickly. It's a very realistic type of greenery. Down here, not so realistic, but definitely metallic when it comes to all of the poinsettias. They've got every gold, rose gold, pink that you can imagine. And I remember the pink being very popular last year. Now this store, they actually had some of their rounders outside and these are very vintage looking holly bushes. Those will do really well and sell out, I'm sure. They also have these picks that look like they almost have little pieces of diamonds in them. They also had the picks out here in the floral. So if you're looking for these whimsical style picks for your trees, look in your floral department, they might be there. Now that snow covered bush, that's one of my favorites. This is another one. I just think you get a lot for $1.25. They did a lot of greenery that I can really appreciate. It's pretty realistic looking and I have to be honest, I think we're gonna have to hold out and see what Walmart does because they might do it for cheaper than $1.25. Sorry, not sorry. I got to save you guys a buck where I can. I hope you guys enjoyed coming with me to three Dollar Trees today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you back very soon. Well, I'm all for Christmas. It's a magical time full of kisses. Take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose.